this is Emily Zlanian with TV Insider, and I'm here virtually with Christina Tonteri Young of Netflix okay. fantasy series Warrior Nun. So, yeah. so I, I've seen a couple episodes. Uh, it's just this amazing, action packed, super fun demon hunting series that is just totally out of left field. Um, I absolutely love it. Uh, you play one of the warrior nuns on the show, Sister Beatrice. I do. Uh, she kind of seems like she's the voice of reason for these women at most times, but why don't you tell me a little bit about what her deal is? What's she all about? Okay, so I play Sister Beatrice, and she, like, yeah, you're right. She is the voice of reason. She is the kind of level-headed one throughout it all. She is the pillar of kind of strength, and, like, she's the basis of, like, we're not going to go do anything crazy here. Everything is okay. Um, but she has this kind of, like, zen spirit that she's kind of able to analyze and like plan according to situations very well um she thinks on her feet she's very kind of yeah she's yeah <laughs> awesome and now we know that all of these nuns and their order will come in contact with this one woman named ava who has yeah. been these very special insane powers now is there going to be an immediate clash when that happens or is it going to be a sisterhood kind of vibe? So the whole series, I think, um, revolves around the idea of sisterhood and of unity with other women. And um, so I think the, we kind of, we, we try to bring her into our circle rather than having like a clash of like, you're not doing what we want you to do. But obviously for her, it's so exciting that she has this new lease on life. So there's going to be a certain tugs and pulls around those kind of dynamics, obviously. Um, but it's, it creates a really exciting kind of um, journey for her and for us to kind of try and pull ourselves together to form this wonderful group of people um, to fight a common evil. <laughs> yeah, a super common evil. <laughs> now, this yeah. is all based on a manga slash comic book. Had you, were you familiar with the source material before you booked the role? I wasn't familiar with the source material before I booked the role. I have had a look at them. I haven't read them all, but <laughs> it, it is more like, and it's, it's, it's inspired by them. It like, it doesn't directly take um, inspiration from like the style of the series, but it is, it is um, inspired by, by the story and the characters, obviously. Um, but the style is slightly different. Yeah. Awesome. Now, you have a ton of insane fight scenes in this series. Yeah. What was training like? Well, I mean, we pretty much got dropped right into it. Like, this, we kind of met each other. We met, this, like, the other sister warriors. And pretty much first day in, we were, like, in the stunt um, warehouse, like, cardboard boxes everywhere, mats everywhere. But it was really awesome. We kind of trained as a group. So that really created this kind of sisterly group dynamic that we need, this team dynamic that we had to have in the show as well. So it really taught us to kind of trust each other. And we went through some like training drills, like military training drills, like how to cover a room, how to bust into a room with guns and in a formation. And yeah, so it really taught us to communicate with each other more, like not even verbally so much, but we just created this great dynamic and communication, nonverbal communication and kind of understanding of each other, which then really well translated over when we were filming um, to we just kind of got on really well. Uh, so yeah, it was great. What was the hardest thing for you to pick up? Like, what are you most proud of that you managed to figure out and like get down, like a punch, a kick, spreading out? Oh. <laughs> What was like the, oh my God, this is going to take me forever. And then you nailed it. Cause obviously you nailed all of it. Um, I was very scared of the knife throwing cause mm -hmm. I was never like sports PE. You had to throw anything. Don't give me anything to throw because I, I usually wear very thick glasses. I'm now wearing my contacts, but yeah. So I was kind of scared of throwing large metal objects at, anything where there might be people near but I pretty much like I learned to throw these knives and I could get them on like a target um so that was I'm pretty proud of that and then we also so my my weapon in the series is pretty unique and so that was it was kind of interesting to because we all have different weapons that are unique to the characters so it was pretty cool to kind of learn to handle something that I, I, I really haven't handled before, but you'll have to watch the show to find out what it is. <laughs> uh, 
Um, and finally, what shows are you binging right now? Because a ton of people are going to come to this and be binging it, but what are you checking out? Um, I actually binged watched um, Unorthodox on Netflix. I loved it. I thought it was beautiful. Um, the Witcher, um, which I also loved. I was waiting for it to come out for so long and I was like, it's finally here. Um, and really randomly, I was watching Bojack Horseman. So <laughs> yeah, so that's a really different type of show. <laughs> but yeah, those are something that I'm quite excited about. Yeah. Awesome. Well, thank you so much for joining me today, Christina. Um, Warrior I Not, everyone should go check it out. It drops Thursday, July 2nd on Netflix. July 2nd, it'll be up there. Watch Female Badassery. Go.